The list does grow longer by the day. J.P. Morgan and McKinsey, the Metropolitan Museum, and the Tate, all institutions cutting ties with the billionaire Sackler family or Purdue Pharma. 这是五月二十九日关于普渡药厂的新闻。其实最近几年来，普渡药厂一直是美国的新闻焦点。理由主要是因为画面上看到的这些白色药丸，药瓶上写着 Oxycontin， 是普渡药厂生产的药品，中文名称是藤石康定。由于具有成瘾性，在台湾是被列为第二级管制药品，用途主要是提供给特定重度癌症病患使用。美国疾病管制暨预防中心数据显示，美国每年因为滥用藤石康定或类似的鸦片药物，导致死亡人数高达四万七千六百人。据《纽约时报》报道指出，鸦片类药物成瘾问题以美洲原住民族族人受害最深。画面里的这位 Brandon Johnson 律师，目前已接受多个部落委托，要起诉普渡药厂。Fortunately, what we've seen is this problem continue to escalate, as we outline in in, in our complaint.、Um, in that now we're seeing more and more Native American children、uh, that are being born addicted to opioids,、um, and it's creating. Uh, really wreaking a lot of havoc in tri tribal communities, even to the point now where we're seeing more Native American children who wind up being put up for adoption、um, as a result of having parents that are addicted to opioids. 专家指出，美洲原住民族之所以成为藤石康定最主要的受害族群，是和美洲原住民族的政治处境离不开关系。I think one of the foundational issues that's really important to understand is that because of our status as sovereign nations. And our relationship with the federal government, when funding is brought from Congress through state block grants to fight the opioid crisis, the states are under no obligation to share any of that funding with tribes, because the relationship is with the federal government. 普利兹奖得主、前《纽约时报》记者 Barry Mayer 认为，藤石康定在美国被大量滥用的原因之一是和普渡药厂过去的宣传手法有关。They convinced doctors that this drug was safe. They convinced doctors that this drug had a lower risk of addiction. They admitted in 2007 that they had lied to doctors. They had lied to patients. They had lied to public health authorities. That The entire marketing of OxyContin had been built on a basis of deceit. 其实早在二零零七年五月十日，普渡药厂就向法院承认藤石康定的宣传有误导成分。法院裁定罚款六亿三千四百万美元，折合新台币大约一百九十亿六千万元。到了二零一七年，奥克拉荷马州州政府起诉普渡药厂，只有大批民众对藤石康定成瘾，导致州政府承受庞大经济和社会压力，要向普渡药厂索取赔偿。这种官司原定在今年五月二十八日交由陪审。团裁决，但普渡药厂稍早同意以两亿七千万美元，折合新台币大约八十三亿四千万元的赔偿金额，换取和解协议。据路透社报道，普渡药厂卷入的法律纠纷还有大约两千宗。Stacy Bolan 指出，要有效解决藤石康定药引危机，原住民族部落必须独立掌握公共卫生资源。But some of the tribes are able to use their own resources、uh, to create clinics, to partner with local and state governments when possible. Washington State tribes in Washington State, led by the Swinomish tribe, are doing an excellent job of creating、um, clinical opportunities for people to receive drug treatment, drug counseling, and preventative measures. So in the Arizona, in, in throughout the country, you're seeing tribes have an insurgence of Returning to cultural ways of knowing and cultural ways of treating addiction, and a revitalization of those cultures as part of the answer that is successful for our people. But we need more investment. 面对藤石康定药引危机 ，Brandon Johnson 接受 Franco Santisu 部落委托，在去年向普渡药厂提出起诉。另外，美国 Cherokee、Chippewa and Sioux、Oneida 以及 Blackfeet 等领地内八个部落，已串联全美各地政府，一同向纽约州法院对普渡药厂背后的萨克勒家族企业提出控诉。记者邱德珍编译。